Previously on Freakish. You're lying. What did you do? I can never trust you again. Cheers, y'all. The hell was in that scotch? The beacon's gone. Where's Ali? Oliver Keller. Where's your sister? They're all dead. Okay, let's go. Do we really know the man Diesel saw was the one who took the guns? He was hauling off my duffel bag. Yes, he took the guns. I don't know what the retrieval photo means. Did you find anything good? I found us a new home. We need to be ready to go at first light. You're on watch here. I'll cover the perimeter. Do you grab me another? Sure. Thanks, beautiful. No problem. What? You held in the lab so long you forgot what a compliment is? Did you have any kids? Past doesn't really matter now, does it? Little girls? Did you call them beautiful like that? Or do they have names? Get some rest, Birdie. Oh, shit. Why can't you do that before the moaners show up? No shit. I told you, no shooting. The noise draws more. Get your masks on. So blending makes green beans and fruit cocktail taste good together? Ooh, with ice. I'm blending it with ice. Oh, ice. I see. Would you like to try? Really tempting, but no. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, I need to get into the freezer. Okay. So, when is the craziness between you two going to end? I don't know what you mean. Uh-huh. Okay, look, I know it's none of my business. Exactly. But it seems like you two were pretty tight before I got here. Things change, Zen. Okay, look, you're disappointed with each other. You feel let down. But look where we are. Now's the time to come together, not let things keep us apart. Oh, you know what? I left my shirt in the shelter. I'm gonna go get it.
should have known they would block the tunnels and the highways out of town. Well, let's try something less obvious. The fire roads, maybe? If we're headed that direction, there's somewhere that I want to stop first. So, you and him? Not exactly. Look, I know I just broke up with Grover. Hey, no judgment here. Zane and I have a history, okay? We get each other. It's comforting. You understand it? It's more than that. But yeah. I had to help Anka and Ollie get out of the cage and call the helicopter. I'm sorry. I had to at least try and find my brothers. You tricked Diesel. Anka threatened to shoot us. She wouldn't have. You don't know that. She's a bitch, okay? I get that. But she cares about her family. And God, you guys had no plan. You're gonna throw Ollie and her out to what? Get eaten? Barrett was doing that, not me. I had to make a choice. I'm sorry if it hurt you. But I'm not sorry that I did it. We do what we have to do in here. I don't like fighting with you. I don't like fighting with you. Then let's stop. Okay. Okay. You want something? What is this? Please don't make me go back to sleeping in that fallout shelter. <laughs> no, that's not what I mean. I mean, like, what is it? I don't know. I like to have a place that's fine. My family, they moved around a lot. Was your dad, like, a, an army or something? A salesman. When we moved, it helped to create my own space, no matter where we landed. I know it's stupid. Nah, nah, it's cool. Do you want to come and chill? No pressure, you just look like you could use a break. Nah. I'm good. I just want to get out of the school and out of the valley and back to normal life. We will. I don't get why anybody wants to stay. Like you were out there. You know we need to rest and be sharp before we leave. People hate me. Since when do you care what people think? Never. Until now. But I don't know. Until now, I totally thought that it was just a matter of time until we got out. And now that's not going to happen. So, you're not getting out on a helicopter. But that doesn't mean that you won't get out. And Ollie? He left me here. My brother thinks that I betrayed him. I didn't. I would never do that. He's the one person in the world I would never hurt. He knew how important he was to me. Why are you being so nice to me? Everybody else wishes I was gone. I guess I haven't always done the right thing. 
So I'm sympathetic to people who don't. I'm so sorry, but you read me wrong. everything we ever owned. Things are replaceable. It's not just that. It's everything. It's what everybody's lost. It's just hard to think about, that's all. Of course it is. I just wish I knew what this photo meant. It means you're a retrieval target. Yes, retrieval target. For what? Grover, we just need to keep driving. Maybe Keller employees are able to get their families retrieved. So maybe they are alive. My parents, I mean. We're going to my house. So you can see if it's still there. So we don't have to talk about this anymore. So I guess we didn't say we were exclusive. What? You know what I mean. Shit. Do you mean Anka? So Zoe was right. You did kiss her. No. No, no, she kissed me. Save it. Violet, Anka kissed me. I didn't kiss back. Right, she pinned you down and puckered up. Honestly, you're not that far off. Oh, please. I know you. You're a cheater. It's who you are. The real question is, is why I thought for even a minute it might be different. I can't believe this. The one time that I didn't do something and I get blamed for. That's called karma, asshole. But I didn't do this. And I'm not letting go of this so easily. I can't trust you. And I can't be with someone if I'm always going to wonder if and when they're going to cheat again. I'm done with to yours. I don't understand why it's intact. There's no clear blast radius. You live here? Yeah. My parents wouldn't let me buy them a bigger house. What about a cleaning lady? They refuse that. I have five brothers and sisters, so this is as clean as it gets.
that been working for a week? It has a motion sensor built in. My brother built it from a kit. Of course he did. <laughs> All right. That's what I'm talking about. Whew. What do we have here? Ladies, a drink on the house? No, thank you. Teenage girl that doesn't want a soda? Come on. I don't eat refined sugar. <laughs> You're one of those. Right, starve yourself so you look beautiful. Listen, drink it. Sugar is energy. She said she doesn't want to. I don't think I asked you. I don't really care. Mind your own business. It's all right. Let's go. Fine. Whatever. I know you think you love her. But whatever they did to her head in that lab screwed with her mind, you know? She's not normal. Nothing good could ever come from being with somebody like that. Why did you side with Earl over me? Why did you force me to take sides? I depend on him to survive. I hate all this. I hate him, but I'd be dead if he hadn't found me. That doesn't mean he gets to treat you the way he does. You know how horrible people can be. You know there could be a lot worse. I just thought they'd be different outside the lab. You're such a weird combo of tough and naive. Earl wanted pickles. Earl's worse than the moaners. We need him. You're stronger than he is. There's safety in numbers. He did fine alone. You can't fight when you have your seizures, and I'm not always going to be right next to you to protect you. How about we take Haley and leave him behind? She can watch over me if an attack happens. Oh, I know you like her, but Haley's useless. She likes me too. It's got nothing to do with this. Then why do you hate her? I don't, but I'd end up protecting you both. You know the way he treats her is wrong, and there's something you can do about it. I know he protects her, and he expects her to help him in return. She doesn't have to listen to him. She does if she wants to stay alive. Now, I have one goal, Birdie, to get you to safety. I want to find you a normal life. And what part of normal will this be? What is this for? So you can see why I did what I did. You mean the explosion? The real story on what Keller Chemical was up to. Project Wednesday. Just reading. I'll be outside when you're finished.
Keller Chemical is experimenting on people? How do you know any of this is real? I trust where it came from. The people I worked with, they had good sources. And now Keller Chemical assassins are killing people. It makes sense they're trying to protect their secret. Barrett, this is crazy. We have to tell people about this. That's what I've been trying to do. But I didn't bring you here to explain this to you. What? Let's fight to the end. Read the signature line. DB and R and HJ. I don't know what that means. Dictated but not read. It's traditionally completed with the initials of whomever dictated the memo. And HJ. You think that? You think that's my dad? Your dad is Norman Henry Jones, yes? Yeah, but he's not the only one with those initials. I know the names of everyone in the lab. These experiments on people. You're saying that's my dad? Your dad is in charge of Project Wednesday. 